Hi, I'm Pete, and this is an HKL Store unboxing. So there we go, there's the box. I ordered this batch of puzzles about three weeks ago, so not so bad. And uh, let's just get right into the unboxing. Now I think I, I mentioned uh, that I was waiting for the rest of my Bermuda Cubes when I did my uh, Champions unboxing recently. And indeed, uh, I was... I got six of them from uh, Champions, but I at that time I'd already ordered um, the uh, first two from HKL Store. But it just so happened that with uh, DHL shipping, uh, I got my uh, Champions order faster. But anyway, it's not been uh, too bad. And in fact, what I was uh, going for on HKL Store wasn't even the uh, Bermuda Cubes. They were just uh, a little extra that I figured I'd get. So let's uh, let's see what I got here. Okay, so there's a couple of Bermuda cubes. That's great. Uh, there's a, another puzzle. That's great. There's a um, gear cube. That's what I'm looking for. And I had asked for some extra stickers. Okay, hopefully these are my gem six uh, extra stickers. And that's what I uh, asked for as well. And there you go. And of course, uh, Calvin's card. Okay. There we go. So you can always uh, get a hold of Calvin. So that's it for uh, for the box contents. So yeah, so so the puzzle I was actually going for, nice screwdriver again, um, is this one right here. Um, it's the geared mix-up, and I guess it's a collaboration between Oscar and possibly uh, Methods. So uh, and I have the uh, Gear Cube Extreme stickering which I really enjoyed. I am not very good at figuring out geared puzzles. I think there's just there's too much stuff uh, going on. Okay, so this has uh, Oscar's logo on one corner and it has Mefford's logo on the other corner. So so there it is. There's a geared mix-up. Yeah, I'm not so good at figuring out puzzles um, with gears. Just, I don't really know why. <laughs> Um, but I, I like solving them, and maybe I'll give this one a try, and I'll try and figure this one out on my own. So this is the gear cube. Um, it actually turns a geared mix-up. It actually turns pretty well. Okay, now <laughs> I've wound it all up here, and I get everything discombobulated. As you see, that's the thing about gear cubes. Um, yeah, it's actually turning quite nicely. So, um, so that looks like, uh, yeah, ah, I see. Okay, so they're calling it the, the geared mix-up. So then the question is... Um, oh yeah, of course, right? We get everything all uh, out of shape. I don't know a whole pile about it, I guess. I guess I should uh, learn a bit more. But it'll just be a fun thing to play with. And I'll, I'll try and figure out uh, some algorithms on my own before I start looking up how to solve it. Okay, so, so that's what I was going for. It's kind of a fun uh, puzzle to have. And uh, so then the other uh, puzzles I decided to get, I decided to try these... Um, Bermuda cubes and th these were my first ones even though I got the <laughs> champions one um, it afterwards uh, some people were posting uh, these on uh, um, puzzle photography on Facebook and uh, I was looking at them and I thought well you know what I really enjoyed the Bermuda series so I'm going to try these um, so so far I managed to solve Venus and I think I'm closing in on Mars I don't really know uh, I know how to uh, place these corners. This is what I'm I'm stuck on on Mars. I know how to place the corners. I don't know how to rotate them. Pretty much everything I've tried uh, has not been successful. So, uh, but we'll see. I'm I haven't I haven't quite given up uh, yet on figuring that out. Uh, but that's the nice thing about these uh, Bermuda cubes is that they're it's a slightly different solve every time. You're going to use um, some stuff that you know. Uh, on one puzzle, but then when you try it, that same thing on another puzzle, it's hard to, um, it, it doesn't work. So I got, uh, this is uh, Mars, Mercury, sorry, Mercury. And uh, this one is the one that only has one, it has the one triangular face, and then the one fissured face, and then all the rest are, well, normal, but I don't know if that's really going to help me much. Uh, I would expect that to turn, so it shows you how much I know it doesn't actually turn. Um, oh, is it going to be like that? Oh, yes, okay, so that's uh, that's kind of cool. And I, you know, this is the sort of thing I really like about these 
these puzzles. Okay, well that's turning quite nicely. Um, if you remember my Champions uh, unboxing, there were two of them, uh, the Venus and uh, the Earth, uh, that were turning really roughly. And I, I took them apart and it turns out there was a lot of uh, uh, sprues on some of the, the pieces. I, I cut those off and then it was working fine. But this, this one's turning great out of the box, has, as did all of the other ones except the two. So the other one I got is, uh, should be uh, Jupiter, I think, is the one. Yeah, there's Jupiter. Okay, so I'm kind of, in a way, I'm kind of relieved because, you know, getting the wrong one of these is a bit of a hassle. Um, so let me show you the box because I think I just kind of skipped over that uh, for the other one. So there's the box. Kind of interesting they come in their own box. Um, there's the, uh, the map. So that's four of them. And I think on the other side there should be other four. Uh, yeah, there's the other four. So, you know, in trying to figure out how difficult they are, you know, using the map kind of will help you a little bit, but it's also pretty hard to predict. For example, I'm uh, I'm solving Mars right now, and it has um, three of these special faces. They're only the single fissure kind of point, right, rather than the dual one, but they're in a row like that. And that makes it really challenging. It's really hard to find... Uh, enough faces to, to do any of the, the regular algorithms um, to, to find unbandaged faces. So um, it is kind of cool. So there you go. And uh, created in China like that. Now this is, do not put any parts in a mouth or choke on it. So basically, you know, they don't want you putting that putting that in your mouth. Uh, and don't dismantle a cube by force. I guess you might, might lose an eye. There's, there's springs and pointy parts in there. So, and then uh, the patent, zero to three was the uh, recommended, no babies, zero to three. So, uh, so that's it. Wait till your fourth birthday. Okay. Um, I think, I think I've covered, and then there's a picture of, I don't know, it, I, somebody's told me that. Mr. Mr. Uh, uh, Bayo, right? Okay, anyway, he has a nice cube collection right there. All right, well, let's, let's take a look at Jupiter. Whoa. Boy, that one, that, I just demolished that box. Sorry about that. Okay. So, yeah, Jupiter was the uh, the other one. And the only reason I picked Jupiter as my, my first one along with uh, uh, Mercury, I was just looking for puzzles um, that, that were slightly different from each other. I think, uh, so Jupiter has three triangular faces around uh, a vertex and then three regular faces but this regular face is bandaged that one's bandaged and that one's bandaged so yeah it's going to be a challenge that's uh let me say that so here you go so those are the uh, bermuda cubes and i'm really happy now that uh, my set is now complete so at the rate i'm going it's uh, probably going to be a few weeks <laughs> to go through these um, yeah, I, uh, Venus took, uh, I don't know, maybe took me about four or five days to solve, uh, maybe, maybe a little less. And Mars, yeah, I've been usually working on Mars for about three days now. So that's, uh, that's what I got from, uh, HK Now store. And, uh, one last little box filler. Got my little screwdriver, of course. Um, my last little, uh, box filler is this kind of cool thing, which is another, uh, conjoined, uh, pair of cubes. And from Cube Twist, I have their, uh, their already have their edge uh, joined one. And now I noticed on the website, I don't, I don't think it's new, but I noticed they were in stock. Um, is they have a, a deeper uh, joining? Now you know I fully recognize that this is basically just a bandaged, a bandaged cube. As a matter of fact, that's how I, I work out how to solve them. I, I get my Cube Twist. Um, bandaging kit and I bandage it in that way and then I work out how to solve it you know sometimes when you're uh, when you're um, solving puzzles uh, you want to have some really mind-blowing uh, uh, effort like that or, or some of the Bermuda cubes and sometimes you just want something that's not too too challenging um, and that will uh, uh, just be, be kind of a fun thing and not be too taxing it's also uh, visually very nice and you know if I'm going to show off some puzzles these are the ones I'm going to grab right because it, it, it's obvious people know what a Rubik's Cube is uh, and then when they see it in this configuration it, it's, it's obviously something very special right so so that's it so I got uh, these um, okay so if somebody says why um, 
that I get more uh, conjoined uh, puzzles? My answer is, why not? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so that's cool. I don't know if that's, uh, is that going to work? Is that, uh, no, that's not really going to work. Okay, so that's, uh, so that's it. Um, pretty happy with all of this and I got everything I asked for. So I'm still waiting for a couple of puzzles from my HK Now store, but this will, this will definitely keep me for a while. And uh, very good turning right out of the box for my uh, uh, geared mix-up. So now I'm going to have to go and uh, learn a few things about it. All right. Well, as always, uh, I appreciate any comments, questions, suggestions on my videos. So uh, feel free to leave some uh, feedback. And until next time, thanks for watching.